Hello everyone, today we're going to be reviewing the Shady Brook Cabin Dollhouse Kit. Uh, it was purchased off of Amazon. It cost about $33 and it shipped for about seven, so altogether it's about a $40 purchase. We got it a little bit over two weeks ago. It is an unfinished dollhouse. It's made out of birch plywood. Nate's grandmother, our son's grandmother, so graciously put it together for him as a gift because he likes to play with the dollhouse at school. We wanted him to help build it, but it just didn't seem like a project he could help do once we received the package. Um, so it was a pretty easy assembly. Um, There's no sawing, nails or screws or anything. Everything's fairly straightforward, for, so it's really good for a beginner dollhouse builder. It comes with a door, but there's no hinges, so the door doesn't work here. But it does come with two built-in flower boxes, which are really cute. So I definitely think that it, it's aesthetically pleasing, like it looks nice, but you can see once the glue, where the glue is, it just doesn't look well put together. It's how they recommend putting it together, and we've already had a bunch of pieces fall off. You can see the front step here is gone. The door, like I said, isn't attached. Um, we were thinking about turning it into maybe like a table for like inside. One flower box fell off. They recommend three and up. It just doesn't seem like it's a very safe toy for that age because it's very breakable and the small pieces are dangerous. We do love the idea of a dollhouse though for our son because it's a lot of creative play and you can kind of really do whatever you want with inside of it. I do think that this purchase was a good lesson for us. It's something that was affordable so it's not too upsetting when it breaks. But it's also something that, you know, Nate's grandma spent a lot of time building, so it would be nice if it kind of stuck around. I wouldn't recommend this purchase, even if it was for adults and wasn't getting played with hard. It just, it doesn't feel like good quality and it just doesn't, it's just not worth the value. So like I said, I don't really recommend this purchase, but if you're just learning how to build a dollhouse and you want to start like very entry level, I would recommend trying this one. And But I wouldn't, I wouldn't expect it to be a, a keepsake. Just something you're kind of using to learn like as a tool because it is fairly simple to put together compared to a lot of other dollhouses. So if you're interested in purchasing this cabin, I'll put a link below. Uh, if you have any questions or comment about the dollhouse, um, leave a comment. And if you like the video, like and subscribe. Where's the mommy hedgehog? Right here. That's the sister. Right here. That's daddy. And who is daddy cooking breakfast? What is daddy making? Is he making pancakes or eggs? Yeah. Or waffles?